Hi everybody, welcome to my dining room, which I've turned into a pseudo makeup studio today, and I'm gonna show you a lot of my secrets from how to look expensive. Today we're on page 115, and I am going to show you how to get the glowy cheek look. Now, I think women really love this when they see it on celebrities, but when they put blush on themselves, it just kind of sits there, and it looks like, you know, like it's sitting on your skin instead of like coming from within. Celebrities, it's not their DNA, it's really what they do. So here, here's the secret. I'm gonna use drugstore products and show you how you can do it at home. This is Physicians Formula. It's one of my favorites. It's their happy blush. Makes you happy. So what I did is I took a little aquaphor, you can buy it right at the drugstore, put it on my hands and I mixed it with this, just in my fingers like this, mixed it all up and then I dabbed it on and as you can see, look at the difference already. She's got that glowy cheek look that's so gorgeous. Let's put a little more over here. This is Alicia by the way. Okay, so isn't that pretty? Already she just looks like she's alive. now. You gotta make sure you don't look like a clown. By the way, one of the things I remember from uh, interviewing flight attendants is that when women put on makeup on an airplane, they sometimes make really crazy mistakes. And that reminded me just what that looked like. So <laughs> you have to make sure that you rub it in. But there you've got that beautiful glow, right? Now, I'm gonna show you what I call the blush sandwich. So once you've got that rosy glow, you're gonna take a highlighter and you're gonna put it right at the tip. The rosy glow is the meat of your sandwich. The highlighter is the bread on the top. Put some on each side. Of course, you're gonna rub it in, always rub it in. See that glow? Now that you've seen that glow, you're gonna see it every time you see a celebrity photo, you're gonna notice it. Remember that I told you it. Okay, then you're gonna take a blush that's a little bit deeper or a powder or a bronzer and brush it right underneath. And there you have it, a blush sandwich. Isn't that pretty? Now, I think she needs a little more color. And here's another secret. This is Nivea Lip Balm. It's called Kiss of Cherry. It's in my book. One of the top makeup artists in the world told me about this. She uses this as blush, and you can too. Again, just like that, I'll add a little bit more. I promise you're not gonna look like, I don't know, like, I, like you've got cherries on your cheeks. <laughs> Looks really pretty, and then, you can also use it on your lips. And there are so many amazing colored lip balms. This is one of my favorites, but there's a big trend in these. A lot of them look like crayons right now. CoverGirl, Revlon make great ones. And it's so easy, cost about $3, and already you look like a million bucks.